All right, today I'm going to be testing out my supersonic ping pong ball launcher. So the theory behind this is using a vacuum to pump out the air in a PVC pipe. So how I made this is I have just a PVC pipe connected to my vacuum pump and I'm going to put mylar rupture seals on either end of it. So and then you rupture one end of it and the air rushes in there very quickly. Because there's a vacuum in there, there's very little limit to how fast the air can rush in there. If there were normal air in there, even if you had a higher pressure air outside of it and you popped it, the air would rush in, but it's limited to how fast the air can get in there. About the speed of sound is as fast as it can go. But when you have a vacuum in there, there's nothing limiting it to how fast it can flow in there. So it can go three to eight times the speed of sound, the air rushing inside of there. So what you do is you have a ping pong ball waiting right here. You pop the rupture seal on this side. The air rushes in there at around three to eight times the speed of sound and it shoots the ping pong ball at supersonic speeds out the other end. It's awesome. Okay, we're almost ready. We can see around the edges there is where most of the impact is. This is just mush here. Hey everyone, that'll conclude my supersonic test for today. But if you'd like to see me shoot my supersonic ping pong balls into anything else, let me know in the comments section. Give me some good ideas for what you'd like to see get destroyed by ping pong balls. Um, and also if you want to see me put anything in my vacuum chamber or my hydraulic press, let me know also, or even under my lens. Uh, and I'll see you next time.